Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I appreciate you guys coming back. I am doing another modified bloom on an 8x8 glass cutting board. I just can't stop. <laughs> I can't stop and I'm not going to for anyone. So um, I hope you like it because that's what I'm doing. I also though am kind of looking at doing other things. I'm doing jar lids, I'm doing furniture, I'm doing glass placemats that are bigger than the 8 by 8s um, All of that is coming. Also, there's going to be a kind of collaboration video. I've reached out to a few of my friends in the art world and uh, we're going to be putting on an amazing video on my channel and they are all helping me out so pretty excited about that so please if you want to see that you want to be subscribed so if you're watching me please hit that button that little subscriber bell so that you'll be notified when that video is up and all the others I appreciate you guys so much thank you thank you thank you from the bottom of my heart thank you so much for watching me I'm gonna get you down on the spinner and we're going to get this thing worked out so I'll see you guys at the end thank you bye well hello everyone and welcome to my channel I'm Angela Bliss and we are testing out some colors today on some glass cutting boards we're gonna do split face modified blooms I wasn't going to film today but I've been cleaning out my studio had a huge influx of orders so we're just going to do a little experimenting while I'm in the middle of orders I'm letting things dry with some new colors so hopefully we'll come up with some cool colors if not I mean you know, we can always scrap it and start over. So, um, I'm starting off with my PPG Multi Pro. It's 473110 interior in the white and pastel base, just house paint. I also have here, it is a color to go by Sherwin Williams in the indigo it's number 6531 um, right here I have this beautiful golden yellow it is pearl golden hour by Arteza I have a beautiful light shimmery green it is the pearl pistachio green I also have four TLPs I have seaweed, I have cappuccino, three TLP colors, sorry, and I have white haven, and I have a copper cell activator, um, it's Amsterdam copper, mixed with Australian Floetrol, three parts Floetrol, one part paint. So I'm going to get this out of the way and we're going to get started. Now we're ready. Okay everyone, let's do this. I have got an 8x8 cutting board taped off and uh, I just left the back plastic on it and taped it around and I'm going to do half of this in the indigo and half of this in the white. Pretty color. White is a little thicker than the blue it seems, but that's okay. Love this blue. Hopefully we won't have too many bubbles. I just paint. I just uh, mix some of this paint, but hopefully it'll be all right. Okay, looks good. I'm gonna give her a little spin. I'm gonna put down a little white over here. I want to have a little more paint underneath where I'm going to blow these blooms out just a little bit. So the yellow and the green that I'm going to use, my husband um, decided that he was going to help me choose some colors and I needed two more colors. 
So he chose the red, the green and the yellow. We'll see how it works. All right, so I'm going to just do two blooms and I'm going to use, of course I want the green and the yellow, mostly on this side. It's kind of thick too. I may have to thin that, that down a little bit next time I use it, pretty sure I am. So we're gonna put the green there, which is the pearl pistachio green. And then we're going to use the pearl golden hour, which is a beautiful yellow. That right there. It's pretty against the blue. I'm going to use the uh, cappuccino. Less so shimmery. And I'm just gonna drizzle the White Haven. And the White Haven is like a interference pale gold, like a beachy uh gold kind of like that and now we're going to use the copper cell activator i haven't used copper in a while okay I think it's gonna be pretty let's see what it looks like Very pale. Um, I think I might need to use a another cell activator with it, maybe. I don't know. I like it though. Maybe I should have used a darker green and yellow. Maybe if I darken those up a little bit. It's got lots of shimmer in it though. I wonder if we darken those those up. Uh, let's see what I got here. Got a yellow and I have a phthalo green in golden fluids so what if we add these to these two yellows and uh so we'll get on the next one we'll see i'm just gonna spin this just a little yeah it's just a little transparent i think it's pretty so let's just uh, bring some color down through here I don't think I'm gonna darken it up. I, I love the light under the copper. You guys leave me a comment on what other colors I should try, if you've tried other colors that work, because I'm really kind of mesmerized by this whole modified bloom split base on glass, and I'm definitely going to be doing it quite a bit. So yeah, let me know. Oh, this is pretty. I take that back. I love it. I love it. And it's gonna be really pretty when it dries. All right, I'm going to lift this off, and thank you guys for watching. You'll be seeing more of these on my channel, so if you like that kind of stuff, and if you haven't subbed already, please do. I'm going to bring you down for a close-up. Hold up. Okay, this is a wet result. I'm going to show you this shimmer. Look at this shimmer. When that's resin, you guys see that? Oh, my God. Hold on. Yeah. It's going to be really pretty. All right. Show you guys when it's dry.
Well, thank you so much for being here with me today, and I appreciate you. If you liked what you saw here, please go to the playlist I have attached, and it will take you to the rest of the wonderful modified blooms that I have created on my channel. Until next time, thank you guys. See you later. Bye.